So Arcade Cohort 1 2026 will be starting anytime soon in the first week of January. So before that, we need to get started. We need to create a new account. Many people are saying, why not old account? So here, because the points controversy, like if you have earned already some of the skill badges, then you won't be able to reach the top tier. That's why create a new Gmail and Cloud Skills Boost account. Here I will show you step by step guide how you can create them. So first thing you need to come over here. This is the website. All the related links will be shared in the description box. Here you have to click on create account for my personal use. Now once you click over here, here it will ask your first name and last name. You have to mention your first name over here. And if you have a last name, you can mention the last name also. Now, once you submit it, it will ask for your date of birth. So you can type anything. Okay. So let me just type. And just select your gender. And after that, click on next. Now, after that, it will ask for a username. So let's add a username. You can write any username, but sometimes it's different. So. So like this you have to select and if you are getting any error that this username is already selected just add any numbers now just click on next and here you have to enter the password okay enter the password make sure to enter it carefully once you have done all these things just click on next and here we have to verify the code So here you have to just scan it. I am just scanning and moving to the next step. You can open your mobile phone camera. So just you can clearly see that here we have to enter a recovery email. So sometimes what happens our email gets disabled. In that case, you have to enter a recovery email so that you are able to get any notification in case you want to reset the password also. I can just add the authenticator also. Now let me just enter the email. After that, you have to simply click on this next option. Now your Google Cloud, uh, Google account is ready. Basically Gmail and Google account is ready. Now here you have to click on I agree and then simply your Gmail will be activated. After that, we'll move forward to the Cloud Skills account. So here you can see all these things are there. You don't have to do anything. Okay, so let's come over here. In the skills profile once you have completed it just click on this sign in or join so if you are new you need to click on this join option now you have two methods to just sign up you can directly create account with google directly or you can use the email and address password okay email and password i mean to say so this is traditional method here you have to enter all your details manually you get an email on a, a personal email whatever you have mentioned the otp will be coming and you have to just verify and create the account so to create the account directly from the Google skills, you have to click on create account with Google. And then simply just select this one, this email address. And once you have selected it, your account will be ready. So just click on continue. And once it is done, it will ask for the date of birth. So you have to make sure the date of birth is uh, correct and according to the terms and conditions so here you can write anything for example you can just add 2000 if you are uh, approx you don't know the, your date of birth mostly everyone knows your date of birth but if you are still under 17 you can just add a simple 2000 or 2005 like this you can just enter the date of birth okay or you can just use your actual date of birth also so there is not an issue in this and then simply click on i accept So finally, your cloud skills account is now ready. Now for getting the 35 free credits every month, you need to join it. For that, I have already made a video. You can watch that video. So here you can see these are the things if you want to verify using other methods also. So you can just use a scan QR code or receive a SMS code. So here you need to verify it by entering your numbers or details. So let me just see what is the criteria.
so when we will click on it you will see that here we have to enter the phone number so we have to just verify that temporary otp credentials and after that your account will be created let me do this step here you have to just from here you have to select your country if you are from india just select i n just type i you see india now enter your mobile number and just click on next you'll be getting the otp i'm doing that step so wait for it uh, gmail has been unlocking access your account has been unlocked and now you can just simply uh, complete the arcade games also now wait for it the unlocking access is being done and we are just being redirected to the gmail now coming to the cloud skills boost once you have created the account the next thing you have to go to the profile section setting section and here you'll find one more important thing that is this make profile public so here you have to just make sure you have checked all the settings once you make sure you have checked all the settings and updated it you will see that here they have mentioned the skills profile so this means your profile is ready whenever the arcade game will start here they'll mention the subscription form you have to fill the subscription form and then simply start your arcade journey so this is the quick thing i wanted to share and do not worry whenever the event will start i'll make a, again a detailed video regarding the events for making people aware that you need to create a new cloud skills boost account for all the details now the most important thing once you have created all the things here you just mention your name any name you can mention and just update the settings because when you join the game a pop-up will come you have to mention your player name and just do it so our cloud skills push profile is ready for the 2026 arcade program and for credits do not worry a dedicated video will be live for the credits if you are having any old account and you have completed the arcade challenges and you still have credits and want to participate and share it for that also i have shared the video you can watch this video how to share the credits from one account to different account and for different queries you can just check the description box i've shared all the related videos regarding the arcade make sure create a new account for the arcade challenges otherwise you'll face some issues